I am really done with first year now. Just submitted my exam. I do you know? Yeah. What do you have to say for this now that I finished my exam? Bro, I'm tired. I may not look like it now, but I'm actually slumped. I only had four hours of sleep. Just like that, that is it. That's the end of first year. You can even hear the echo as well. Look how empty it is. It's just like when I first moved in. My fit is decent. The fours. And I got the strap tee. My obsession with strap tees are on match, man. I went to this place, though. Number three, Falving School. This place rode me throughout the whole of first year, man. So in one whole year here. You'd actually think you'd stay in the same place for uni throughout the whole course, but you don't. You have to switch it after a year. The only thing left is to drop these keys. Are you, man? It's about time. She really cannot believe it, man. Damn, damn, damn. And it feels like it was yesterday when I moved into this place, man. All of this, all of this was random. It's about time I gave my keys in. I'm gonna come out of this place another man. Just like that, drop the keys, man. It's a new era. Minus the domino thing. This is how my keys look like before. I don't know why I have this domino thing. I don't need it. I just go on the website regardless. Looks like I'll be seeing this place next year, then. See you next year, Lapius. See you in September. Back in is right now. Don't mind the noise. My rooms are, man, the tire mess. I haven't unpacked or anything. It's gonna take me a while to unpack too since I literally took out every single thing in my home. I'm gonna get back to you guys when I'm done unpacking and everything and I've settled in properly. Uh jeez man. After so long I finally decided to clean my room. It looks much better now. Obviously it's not perfectly tidy but it looks so much better. Like everything's more organized. LED lights are here too. They may not be on the wall and that but like <sighs> I mean, it still looks nice like this regardless. I even prefer it more like this as well. Let me even show you how it looks like without the main light being on. Voila. It's a whole vibe. You don't, need it. you don't need it to be on top of the walls. You don't need it to be on the walls. It can look nice even like this as well. And it's still going to be just as effective. You can even go to bed in this kind of vibe, man. It looks hella nice. Wow. First year of uni, already done. It went by so quickly. It feels like September 2021 was just yesterday. I know that sounds hella cheesy, but it's actually true if you think about it. Like, I was able to do quite a lot of things. I made a lot of friends. I also got to find out stuff about myself, stuff that I like, stuff that I don't like And I feel like me going to uni actually helped me grow as an individual too There were certain things I didn't know that I do know now And that's only because of uni I don't want to be one of them YouTubers that always like to give tips about uni Because a lot of it is just self-explanatory Always make sure you have some money You're going to be using a lot of money throughout university And if you don't have any money, it's just peak like, I know some of you men that are in uni now Spend most of their money on Uber Eats, Just Eats And just to buy pizza and that like And 2am pizza We've all done it before. Uber Eats, Just Eats, just cut it out. But you're gonna run out of peas. Luckily for me, I didn't spend much on Uber Eats anyway. Mostly because I like making food at home. The only time I'd actually even buy stuff from those sites was when I was with my guys. I don't like ordering pizza, hot, dominoes, all that kind of stuff. Just on my lilies, fam. That's depressing. And the food takes bare long to come as well. And it's expensive. Especially if it's just you ordering it. But if you're ordering it with like five other people, then it's patent. It's not that expensive because everyone's chipping in at the end of the day. And speaking of chipping in as well, remember, your guys will be stingy at the end of the day we'll all break out here man and when you're broke you become stingy that's just how it is like i said before you knew what is fun as well like at the beginning there were hella parties <laughs> first day I came to uni I went to my first party that's when I started meeting people that I still talk to till this day it's just crazy man uni is, very, is a very spontaneous place one minute you're just cleaning up the kitchen the next minute you're out of your friends at like 10 p.m. or something at parties try and just put yourself out there try and actually go to as many parties as possible when you're on uni that's the best way to make friends other than like joining societies and that everyone wants in the same boat as you everybody just wants to socialize get to know people this is one thing that nobody talks about as well nobody talks about what happens two three months after uni that's when that like, uni actually starts hitting it's not live or after that it turns two three months it's like a fantasy then after that it just becomes dead like literally you'll be end up becoming more antisocial than you've ever been before uni can go up like this or it can go down like this it can go both ways like if you're somebody that suffers with social anxiety then it's kind of beautiful you still i know this is not related to the video whatsoever but i do need a drink gee there is no fade here oh my no fade here at all as well this is not looking good it's not looking good bro I'm not here looking like one 
fat uncle now. This can't run whatsoever, man. I look like Steve Harvey back in the 90s, man. This is not good. Uni just kind of dies down at the end of the year by like December and that. It can also go up as well. There's still parties that happen, but it's not as prevalent as it was at the beginning of the year. Before going into uni, it's always good to do a self evaluation of yourself as well. Understand the good qualities about yourself and the bad qualities about yourself. And yeah, you'll be patterned. Just make sure you also pick a good accommodation, preferably one that's close to where your course is as well. This doesn't only apply to my university, it applies to Norths, it applies to Burns, Aston, Brighton, all them kind of unis as well. Like, just make sure the place you're staying at isn't too far away from where you have to be for lectures and that you're gonna have to make a treacherous journey if you're gonna pick an accommodation make sure it's nice you don't want to like pick one accommodation just out of nowhere do it early enough don't just leave it till last minute when it comes to like friends just make sure you take your time to understand who you're chilling with you don't just jump yourself in there anyhow everything else is just generic stuff that your mum your dad your brother your sister everyone around you has told you just make sure you keep it 100 yeah, you don't want to end up doing a 180 on everyone else that's not gonna look good on you people are gonna think you're not a genuine person like it's not a good look basically behave the way you behaved before you entered university and obviously develop as well there's a difference between developing and then switching switching is when you completely change your personality that you shouldn't do your real personality will show itself i hope you guys enjoyed the video it's just nice to be back home for the summer holidays it's just just a good time to relax even though in uni you're already relaxing that's another thing as well university is not school it doesn't have a rigid st structure like it's very relaxed you're basically working on your own timeline so yeah lectures on every single day as well lectures are only like probably two three times a week and then you have a lot of time to yourself as well you use your free time doing a hobby something like that like going to the gym playing a sport all that kind of stuff like the generic stuff in it be yourself and you will enjoy yourself it's jay money and i'm signing out in a bit you man